Hello, nerds, and welcome to Four Nerds Gaming. You're on with Happy Bandit. Keelan. The wife. And the missus. And we're back playing Skyrim. Mittens McBadass has Meow. been lonely. We had to play with our pussy. Just just for a moment, remind everybody what our character looks like by uh, changing the view. We are about four seconds in. We are going to say a cuss word. Meow. <laughs> Nice tail. Tail. And I said we were playing with our pussy. He's our pussy cat. And, uh, ladies and gentlemen, stop the presses. There's an Xbox in Keelan's house. Uh-huh. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, that's the first. yeah y'all might want to check on hell because <coughs> it might have frozen over. Yeah. But uh, it's mine. It's not his. Yeah, no. Not yet. Maybe someday. Uh, so. <laughs> oh, wrong button. We were just talking about... What were we talking about? Uh, Evercrack. Uh, yeah. Evercrack. <laughs> <laughs> you have no Yeah, you were about to say something is. about Everquest. Okay. Um, oh, easy. Yeah. Um, Everquest 2. Back in the PS2 days, uh, the wife and I played uh, EQOA Everquest Online Adventures. Um, we pay, um, played a buttload yeah, it was a lot of we, Everquest. Yeah, they're all like hidden, aren't they? He's all running in the hall and yeah. praying. He's over there somewhere. Kneeling somewhere. There he is. Yeah. So um, we kind of missed that. So we decided, you know, EverQuest, the PC version, I think I did it again, ah. uh -huh. is uh, it's free to play now. Well done. Mm -hmm. you You're a good dude. You're a good You're a good dude. It is time for us to recognize you. Lots of talking in this. I know. So okay, it's free so to play. So anyway, it's free to play, but you he were limited on like three races and three classes, and it's a ridiculous human, barbarian, and uh, yeah, you can buy the other, other races and other classes. Yeah, Barbarians where you can upgrade. Race. Yeah, that's like that. uh, yeah. That's one of those things that like it's companies are finding out that if they go free to play, they'll make more money. Oh yeah, because they give you a very limited version of this game. They give you a taste of the crack, and yeah. then you have to buy more. Yeah. It's like, I've heard League of Legends is a great game. Um, and it's free to play. But you can spend so, so much money unlocking classes and characters mm -hmm. and I, stuff like that. I heard somebody say the other day, they've spent more money on free games than games they've paid for. Right. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And, uh, like, the... Uh, the free-to-play model is kind of taking over almost. Mm -hmm. um, I don't know if y'all are familiar with the... Uh, I hope I pronounce it the Ouya. Mm -mm. It's a new console Ooh, yeah. mm -hmm. that's coming out oh, it's, in March. It's one by Google. Google. It's a Google console. console. Mm -hmm. okay. uh, yeah, it's, yeah, it, it, it started as a Kickstarter project, didn't yeah, it? Yeah, it runs Android. Mm -hmm. And, um, you know, it'll play, you know, all the, uh, the you know, Angry Birds and... Sort of mobile type games. Um, yeah, you can download apps and, onto uh, it like you do a smartphone, right? Yeah, I, I mm. think so. I'm not. I'm not 100 yeah. percent sure on it, but if you got in on it while uh, they were doing the Kickstarter project and paid or ki donated 99 dollars, I think it was. Well, it's it's or more. It's still then you got a free one. Yeah, it's still 99 dollars to buy. Mm -hmm. So uh, that's actually not a bad price considering what you pay for the other consoles. Yeah. You know, so and yeah. it's it's like you get to have all those free apps you know on your on a console yeah you know? well i'm i'm still interested to see exactly how well it works um yeah you know if it comes out and it's it's just blowing people away mm -hmm. you know a hundred dollars is, is yeah. not a lot and well, there's no disk drive you download all your games well what it also it's uh Hi, is open. sorry i got distracted Wait a minute. What are we doing doing this quest? But I don't know. Did I not just get unrelenting force here? Yes. No, yeah, you just finished that. You just finished it. But so um, I have to go up and talk to him. Oh, you know what? Arngar. You completed a different quest. Yeah. Go talk to him and complete you this. That's the one You I completed needed. the horn, and so, yeah. Oh, wow. You never completed that? No. no. That's crazy. So, um, there you go. I need the shell. My biggest concern is with the free apps and everything, yeah, I've learned... Apps. That, you know, just like with downloading stuff on your computer, you know, you can get viruses 
from yeah. apps. You know, it's I've seen it happen before on smartphones. You download an app and you get a virus. Yeah. So I think that would be something that would be a concern to me with all the amount of free mm-hmm. stuff. So that's something that I'm really, I really am careful about what apps I put on our iPad and what apps we put on stuff. Yeah, you know, it's not it's not as much of a problem as it's not as big a problem with Apple products as it is yeah. with um, well, Android. And I learned uh, we learned the hard way to disconnect the auto pay from our bank account from our iTunes account because our daughter was playing a um, a little Elf on the Shelf game that I downloaded that was free. But to unlock the extra clothes to dress up the elf, you if you hit them, it prompted, you know, would you like to pay for this? My mom had and to disable hers, too, on her iPad. Normally, you have to put in the password, and that keeps the kids from uh-huh. buying stuff. Well, since I had logged in, already within a recent amount of time to download that app it was still logged in and it went ahead and charged our bank account for uh the dollar 50 that it was for the the oh, app nice. yeah, my kid owes me a dollar 50 <laughs> make her work she it off. she did it twice make her scrub toilets two different two different games oh. so she owes you three bucks so she owes us three bucks um i have made her make up for this though Good. i have i've made her do some chores around the house she's not cared for uh, what wait wait, wait. Forgive me. I will so dang That was weird. It wasn't, it wasn't until I moved that he actually prompted that. That's Master weird. I yeah, you get pissed off and start to walk away, and he's like, wait, 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 wait. Yeah, his, his master spoke to him. So, um, so EverQuest oh, Anyway, online. let me finish one. I want to say a minute ago about the... Uh, the, the yeah. I forgot how to pronounce Ooh, it. Yeah. It's, it's not really... No, I think it's pronounced something different. But anyway, it, the uh, it's also open source. No. Mm-hmm. So... There, people can develop their own mm-hmm. applications and pre games and stuff for it. So it's supposed to, it's designed to be, you know, way more open source, user friendly. Mm-hmm. You know, so people can create their own stuff and yeah, like it is with the Android apps. Yeah. you know. So I think it'll definitely be something interesting. Gandalf should see where it goes because you know it's there's definitely a need for it. I think. Because you don't really get a whole lot of that from any of the consoles that are out right now. So. Yeah. 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 Well, I was, I was looking at it today, and it, it said it's designed to be hacked. Yeah. You know. Yeah. Right. So. The, yeah. The thing that I find interesting is if, you know, if this is the new wave of, you know, how things are going to be in the future where you download everything, you know, that sort of thing, that's going to completely do away with, you know, used games. Yeah. Completely that, yeah. kill that industry. I, I've... I, the rumors are saying right now that the next generation of consoles, that's how it's going to be. It, it, it'll lock. Mm-hmm. It, I mean, it'll be a download uh, method. And It'd have to have and a that's huge um, that, memory, though, yeah. to be able to do that. That was one of the things that bugged. Well, they've got the cloud memory. You just store it in the cloud, you know, on the well, it's not and that stuff big. like that. But, I hate the cloud. But, um, <laughs> but with my books this last semester... Because of all the digital stuff they're doing with the books, I had to buy digital copies of books and that went with programs that I had to use for these math classes I had. And I can't resell those, mm-hmm. you know, like I can regular books and, you know, stuff like that. So I basically, I paid a hundred and... I think it was $120 for each of these digital copies of books You'll with the never program. never see that again. And I can't resell it. I can't reuse it. The only way I can ever reuse it is if I retake a class or take a class that has the same textbook. Right. And it's basically, once you pay for it, it's useless again. Yeah. You know? Like, well, there's no resell value. Like, that's the one thing I always kind of took comfort in, in in the textbooks is I'm buying these textbooks, but at the end of the semester, I can either resell them you know, to the school, or I can resell them online. And so, well, it as just kind of sucks. As far as games goes, Steam has kind of set the, the bar on, on digital distribution. Mm-hmm. And uh, you know, I heard a really good commentary about this the other day, where he's talking about how, you know, if game comes out, it's 60 bucks. Okay. Um, two months, three, four months down the line, you know, for for a company to say, okay, um, Target, Walmart. You're hurting yourself. Don't do that. You're on fire. Stop, drop, and roll. I'm sorry. Go right ahead. I'm on fire. Uh, you know, to say, you know, Walmart, Target, Amazon, Best Buy, uh, you know, all of you, GameStop, all of you, change the price of your game 
of, of this game to this this thing. That is a whole lot more work than, you know, on, on Steam it's like, they're like, okay, so this game came out, it was 60 bucks. Four months later, uh, we're just going to drop the price. Yeah, and they you do know? the summer sales. And they and do these sales that are ridiculous. 70% off yeah, I mean, and crap like that. And, uh, but yeah, the, the whole thing with the going digital, you better not charge me 60 bucks for a game if it's going to be digital. Yeah, yeah you know, and that. yeah, because my, my main thought here is that, I'll, okay, it takes a lot of money to develop a game. It takes a lot of money to pay the people, you know, doing the art, doing the writing, doing the coding, all that stuff. But you've just lost a huge amount of, of cost from physical media. Right. And the like the transport pass, of it and pass everything. That, pass that on. Yeah. You know, I mean don't don't be greedy. Or if you're gonna charge sixty bucks for it, put that money into getting voice talent and stuff and getting writers that can write a decent game. Right. You know, I hate when you pay sixty bucks for a game and it just it's the same five people doing the voice yeah, acting exactly. for every single character. Oblivion. You know? <laughs> so, it's just... Stinking that. Xbox. <laughs> Trolls are backwards. Trolls are backwards, that is. What? Did you See? say what, fuck go? <laughs> it said, oh, fuck you all. Because <laughs> you were talking bad about the Xbox, and it was like, oh, fuck you, Keelan. <laughs> Because we're a family-friendly right. program, I can I can yell out "fuck you." Yeah, we're not. So obviously, one not of our friendly. one of our yeah. main talents depending here, on what, how your family is. is cussing. One of our main talents here, obviously, is staying on point. So EverQuest. <laughs> EverQuest. Oh, yeah, EverQuest. I, know. I don't even know what I'm going to say about it. You were going to talk about um, the fact that you tried it and what you thought of it. Oh, okay. Well, you're like about to die. I am. My gosh. Come on, come on, heal, die. heal, die, die, so that die, somebody else can die. play. Fight me, so I can play. Bear it and share it. Okay, so EverQuest. Anyway, um, we played it back on the PS2, and you know those games were those games were designed to play. Oh crap! What the heck? Yeah, go ahead, and take care of it, Lydia, for me. Take care of my lot work. Hmm. And let me just say that I was addicted to this game. I, we got to See, a point where I don't remember exactly why or how, but we got to a point where we could no longer play it, and I actually cried yeah, over this PlayStation game. Yeah, you guys are the first people I've ever met that's played EverQuest on console. Uh, most everybody I've ever known that's played EverQuest, it was on PC. You need to clear the weather. Yeah. Oh, anyway, oh, anyway, so we, we never played it on PC, mainly because we haven't got a very good PC. What the heck? There we go. Yeah, we don't play much on PC. We I mean, play Minecraft on PC. That's you know, about it. When I was younger, I played a lot on PC, but then it got to the point to where you had to have a badass computer to do anything. Mm -hmm. And so I have not. You have to have a huge video card. Yeah, and so yeah. I've got cheap computers. I'm not, you know, made of money. So we started getting more into console stuff just because, you know, you put it in, you play it. There's no upgrading hardware. There's no nothing. I'm going to die. Yeah, so, someday. Um, so some, some. We are gonna have a badass gaming computer, and yeah. I'm, I'm gonna hire a freaking nanny or something, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna develop a wow addiction like you would not believe. <laughs> now that'll be after the kids are all out of the house. Yeah, exactly. That's what we'll be doing when we're. Like, My grandkids are gonna be like, Grandma, can I come over? I'm gonna be like, No, I'm yeah. playing wow. Playing wow. Yeah. So anyway, uh, we played it on there, and we loved it. We played it a lot. In a related story. You know, I probably shouldn't have mentioned that. <laughs> I must have mentioned something personal. Probably not a good idea to put that on the internet. But anyway, uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm in hindsight. Uh, so anyway, EverQuest, uh, you know, we loved it. We played the heck out of it. But it was so antiquated and old. And, and so I finally just got to the point where I quit playing. And so we thought, you know, a friend of mine I work with, so, you know, that thing's free on, on PC now. So that would take, I downloaded it. And... <sighs> My gosh, it is so hard. The game is way more advanced, obviously. Anything you put out on PC has got way more options, way more controls, way more whatevers. But but the uh, it just does not compare to the ease of a console. 
Yeah, it's like the difference between playing Minecraft on the PC and playing it on the the Xbox. Well, yeah. that, I don't know. That's different. I'm almost I almost prefer it's on the PC. To, yeah, I was See, say, I, I think, think it's, it's easier, easier on the on, on the. Uh, I disagree in that one. Yeah. Just because the mouse use is so much easier. Well, that's because I have a crappy computer. And so it doesn't true. lag on the Xbox. Well, that that's true. The, the so, lag does suck. Even a mon- I've got a. That's the biggest thing that in, that in inhibits oh, me on Minecraft is the lag. Your aim.